Before we begin, I recommend making a separate Google account as the account we'll be using will only be used for extracting vocals and instrumentals. If you use it on your personal account, it'll just take space on your Google Drive. So make a new one while you're at it. Download the archive link and then extract it. Next, upload the vocal removal folder to your Google Drive. Now, do not upload the file to your drive, only the folder within the file. Click on the collaboratory link and then go to File and Upload Notebook. Next, click on the Discord link to download the vocal removal file. Once it's finished, go back to the collaboratory link, click Choose File, look for the vocal file you just downloaded, open it and it should be uploaded to the collaboratory. Once it's done, you'll be taken to another page where you're ready for the next step. First thing you want to do on the next page is go to Edit, Notebook Settings, and change the Hardware Accelerator to GPU and press Save. Next, you'll want to click on the first step, and you should be given a link that allows the Colab to add files to your Google Drive. Click the link, select the account you want to use, press Allow, copy the code, and paste it back to the authorization box on the Colab page. Let's do its thing. And continue to press the buttons on each step until you reach step 5. Upload whatever song you want to extract to your Google Drive. Next, go back to the collab link and go to step 5. In it, replace the your track file here dot flack text with the file name of the song you uploaded to your Google Drive. Note, it must be the exact same name as you put in your drive and it also has to be the correct file type. Example, if the file is song.fp3, you type in song.fp3 to the file, to the step. Finally, click on the next button to the fifth step and begin the extraction. Once it's done, go back to the Google Drive and go to Recent. There, you should find two files to add it to your drive. One being an acapella version of the song you selected and the instrumental version. You can also find it in the search bar of your drive by typing the name of your song. Now let's say you close the collaboratory link and want to extract another song. First, you go to the collaboratory page, click File, open Notebook, and click Vocal Remover. You'll be taken back to the Vocal Remover page, and you'll have to do steps 1, 3, 4, and 5 again. Step 2 is already complete, but you'll have to redo those previous steps again. Hopefully you'll find this tutorial helpful, and enjoy your extract instrumentals. The rest of the video will just be the results of using instrumental extraction. Sweet man. 